Hi there, in this video I will show you how you can create a lollipop chart like this within Tableau. So what I am using is the sample superstore which comes with a Tableau evaluation version or if you are using any personal copy also which is licensed you will find Tableau superstore. So we will see how we can create a chart with this uh, with this data set and uh, let me create a new sheet. And what I want is first of all on rows the different categories. So maybe what I'll do is I will just drag the subcategory over here. And then what I want is sales on column and again sales. So now I have these sales on two different axes. And what we will do is we will use the dual axis to create the lollipop chart. And it can be considered as one of the example of dual axis chart as well which I think covered in the previous video as well. So I will just go on the second pill and uh, click on the dual axis. So right now what it has done is uh, converted everything into a dual axis, but that's not what I want. Uh, I'm just coming over here and changing it to a bar chart. All right. So once we are here, uh, we have a bar chart and we have at the end, if you see, we have a circle. So what I'll do is just increase the size of the circle a bit. If you see, it has increased a lot. It's a big lollipop. Um, I think this is good. And then I'll go to first sum of sales and decrease the size a bit over here. If you see, so we can just experiment based on when we want and how we want it. So after this, you have your lollipop chart ready, like the one we created over here. It's just that the thickness of line and the size of the circle is relatively big. Now, one other thing I will just show you to make this chart a bit more interactive is how we can change the color of this circle, which is kind of a lollipop. So what I'll do is I will, I am here on the second sales bill, which is basically a circle. If I can see it over here and I will just drag the profit to color. As soon as I drag it, you see that the line, the line color, or this bar color is changed as well as the color for these lollipops. So what it is indicating is if it is orange, that means uh, it is a negative value and there is no profit, but loss. Over here it is relatively more or less loss but if it is blue it means it is a good category where you are having a profit now if you want you can change the color of bar if let's say that does not suit you by coming over here go to color and make it black right and based on that you can adjust how you want to display it and make your chart more interactive which is a lollipop chart 